We're gonna have Miguel Cotto fighting Saddam Ali. This will be Miguel Cotto's final fight. So after this, Miguel Cotto is going to retire now. If you guys didn't know, I've been a big fan of Miguel Cotto his entire career. I basically grew up watching Cotto back in the mid-2000s. I was a little kid back then. I saw all the Cotto's fights. So, uh, it's kind of bittersweet, you know. But I've seen a lot of people complain about this, uh, saying, Oh, Cotto should have fought uh, Charlo. He ducking Charlo. The thing is, Cotto really earned the right to just have to fight whoever he, the fuck he wants to fight for his last fight. Uh, I mean, look at Floyd. When Floyd Mayweather retired in 2015, did he... The last fight he ever took was who? Was against Andre Bertel. Back then, a lot of people wanted him to fight Keith Thurman. Remember that? A lot of people were saying, yo, fight Keith Thurman, fight Keith Thurman. But what did Floyd do? He fought and he elected to fight Floyd elected to fight Andre Bertel. Floyd didn't fight. Floyd didn't fight um, Keith Thurman. He didn't fight the best guys. Everybody wanted to see him fight the, the best guys, right? But he didn't. He fought Keith Thurman. I mean, he fought Andre Bertel. I think Miguel Cotto's in the same situation. Miguel Cotto, people want to see him fight Charlo, but... Charlo hasn't done anything at middleweight or whatever, uh, light middleweight or whatever, as of yet. And Miguel Co and like I said, Miguel Cotto has really put in the work already, so he's just gonna fight easy fight. By the way, this is gonna be easy work for Miguel Cotto. Miguel Cotto is gonna destroy Saddam Ali. Saddam Ali is a very. I used to think he had he had some decent boxing skills, but. Then he fought Jesse Vargas, and that was his first step up to world level. And when he fought Jesse Vargas, he got destroyed by Jesse Vargas. Jesse Vargas destroyed him. He absolutely destroyed him. Uh, and uh, Jesse Vargas is not a puncher, so if a guy and he's not as and Jesse Vargas is not as good as Miguel Cotto, so if a guy like Jesse Vargas was able to destroy and dispatch of and really expose somebody like a Saddam Ali, then Miguel Cotto, who's a better fighter than Saddam Ali, I mean, than uh, Jesse Vargas, and who hits harder than Jesse Vargas, will definitely destroy Saddam Ali. Uh, many people might look at him as like, you know, he's the younger guy. Yeah, he's the younger guy, Saddam Ali, but he's not the better guy. He's maybe a top 25, 30 type of fighter, and Miguel Cotto should really dispatch of him easily. I'm definitely picking Miguel Cotto to win. I'll be shocked if Saddam Ali proves me wrong. If he does, he, he, I'll give him credit, but I just don't think he's going to be able to do it. And, uh, yeah, that's all I have to say, guys. If you watched the video, thanks for the video. Uh, and uh, I'll see you guys next time. I'm out. Bye-bye.